everybody. I have a Dollar Tree Halloween Fall Haul. I went with my granddaughter the other day and I picked up this house and I'm only going to do this house I think. I'm not going to do uh, stackable but I'm going to make this a haunted house because I'm doing Hocus Pocus. So somehow I want to incorporate Hocus Pocus into this and I don't know how I'm going to do it yet but I got that. Then this is metal. I like this. Happy fall, y'all. And it's metal, like I said. And I don't know that I'll hang it. I may put it into... I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do, to be honest with you, but I thought it was cute. Then they have these two signs. Welcome to our haunted home and the witch's inn. And again, because I'm doing... The Hocus Pocus. I got that. The other thing was this hot apple cider. Homemade hot apple cider served here. Mold with cinnamon sticks and cloves. This will be really cute with a fake bake, don't you think? I think that'll be adorable. This is a really cute sign. I wouldn't do anything to change it. No, I wouldn't do anything to change it. Then I got some of this. I think I'll try to put on a fake bake. And it's like a, well, it's called twig garland. The only thing I don't like, I hate the fallout of this glitter, but I think on a fake bake it might be cute. But boy, I, oof, look at that. I don't like that. Then I got some more of these berry picks in the black. The orange. And purple. Those would be cute on fake bakes. Then I got this material. It's just candy corn. And I want to get some of their candy corn. Uh, the styrofoam ones, they didn't have it yet, but they'll get them in. Then for Hocus Pocus, it's Bank Member, the black cat. I thought that would be cute to paint these and maybe put them on a cake or a cupcake. I'm waiting to get the witch's hats, uh, the three in a package. They didn't have them. And then this boo, I thought this was really cute. You could do really cute things with uh, napkins or tissue paper or rice paper. And there are three pieces of these. I got some of these wooden apples. Wouldn't they be cute? And on a cupcake or a cake with this hot apple cider sign. Then I got two of these. The Happy Pumpkin Season and Spice Up. I don't necessarily care for the look of it. I may paint some of this. But I think I'm going to put these together and do something with them. But I don't necessarily. This one I like better than I would take these bows off. I don't know yet, but I think I'm going to revamp these somewhat. Then the pumpkin pie sign, everyone's talking about, absolutely adorable, and the apple pie. Okay, the other thing which I was really happy to find, they still didn't have other things that I needed, but I was thankful to find the things I did. These little mushrooms. These are really good when you're working with wood for different things to rise it up. I did find the witch's hats for my Hocus Pocus, so I can paint these and put them on cakes or cupcakes or whatever. So I'm glad I got those. Heidi ho, here we go, rocketing into a brand new show. <laughs> Hi guys, how are you? I just got home from work and I was on my mission to find the infamous witch's form that I'll show you in a minute. Actually, I should have got two, but I didn't. That's okay. All right. This, this has to be the end of my Dollar Tree hauls for fall and Halloween. Well, fall. Halloween, fall. Oh, can you tell I've worked all day? <laughs> and now it's 8 o'clock at night. Okay. Oop. 
sorry. Yeah, see? First thing, you guys, what do you think? Leaves are falling. Autumn is calling. Three guesses what I'm going to do with this. Anybody know? Mm-hmm. If you say checked, you're right. I'm going to make it Mackenzie Child. Better known to my very good friend Lisa Diaz, Mackenzie Phillips. Then, because I'm decorating with the Sanderson sisters in mind, you guys, look at these. These are beautiful. I don't know if you can tell, but they're a little bit, it's not glittery like the glitter that, you know, where it falls into your hands. Not like that at all. And then it has this little mesh <clears throat> bow. And look. Isn't that pretty? So I got two of those in black. Really cute. Then I found one black pumpkin. Because I use these for faux food as well, okay? So they had a black one, and they had another one, and I didn't realize, but it didn't have the stem. Not that I'll keep the stem on it, but it was kind of banged up, so I didn't get it. But I got this one, and I get them at Halloween because, like I said, I use them for cakes. And then just regular white. Just regular white, guys. You can do whatever you want with it. So those. Not necessarily for Halloween, but I just want to have them on hand. Then, I thought these were adorable, and at Hobby Lobby, they have these, and I think, I'm not sure, but I think they're like, gosh, I want to say $2.99 or $3.99. How pretty is that? The purple, they didn't have any green, so I just got orange and purple. Now this haul that I'm doing, everything that you're seeing has been done over a few weeks' time. This wasn't all just in one day. But look, the black and purple. Isn't that pretty? Then look at this. Because of the witches, the crescent moon, isn't that pretty? And I won't do anything to this to change it. I'll just leave it the way it is. Then, I had to get these. Now, I don't know quite how I'm going to use them yet, but I got three for the three sisters. Sisters? So I thought those were cute. Like Again, I don't know how I'm going to, uh, how I'm going to use these yet, but I will. Then I just had to get some more Mod Podge and some tacky glue. The last, well not the last thing, second to the last. Look at these foam roses. I can use these in my fake bakes and not have to use the, eye, the spackle. Look how pretty those are. They are very, very pretty. Very pretty. And then, the thing that I went for, the witch it is form. So we'll be doing a DIY with that very shortly. So that is my haul. Like I said, it's got to be the last. I mean, enough is enough. Then at Hobby Lobby, I got some purple model magic, because I'm going to make a cake. And I think I'm going to use this like a fondant. And then, for my cookies, because remember we got all of our cookie cutters, so I want this to be like they do if they were to put fondant on their cookies. You know the icing that they do that's real smooth? So I, and I couldn't wait because I didn't know if they were going to be on sale. Because their sales have been changing, guys. It used to be where it was always alternating, but it's not that way anymore. And I don't know what's going on. So I couldn't wait. So this is expensive. These are expensive, I'll tell you. 
but I got the green, the neon, well it's called electric lime, this is purple, again it's going to go with my theme, and then the black and the orange. So that's it, so now that I've shown you all of my hauls, now we'll get started on the DIYs. Guys, until we get together again, remember, the world's a better place because you're in it. Don't forget that there's only one you, and you bring something to this world nobody else can. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.